Hey, this is James. I'm the unofficial mayor of Cowboy Country. Welcome back to the channel. i uh, got a special surprise for you. We are at Prairie View A&M. And I'm telling you, for a small school, this is a really nice stadium. I saw parking enforcement over there. They told me to park where I park. But look at what I see. I see an open gate. So... Let's go inside and take a peek. This. I like how that building is, encloses that one end zone. Look at those chair backs. This is a nice stadium. Love the grass berm. That's pretty cool. Okay, there are no suites, clubber suites on this side. But there are concession stands up there. That's really good. Okay, club and suites up there. All right, I love the chair backs. That, that adds something, the color, the school colors. Oh, and even the letters, if you look at the building, the letters are in the school's colors. Those are purple, it's not, it's not black. That's cool. All right. Okay, look at this. So I like the, the foliage, the trees. See the banners, how it adds to the atmosphere. The, you got the school's colors. You got different pictures of, I think, famous people. You know, people that have played here in the past. That's, it just adds to the atmosphere. Ticket office, very clearly written. It's Panther Stadium. Considering I used to work at the gates at Oklahoma State, the fact that it clearly says no re-entry makes my heart warm and fuzzy. There were Saturdays where we had to scan people out to let them go outside. I'm telling you. What I love is, see how these markers, they're in the school's colors. That's really cool. Even the signage. It's purple that's cool I think this is their basketball arena not the most exciting building in the world but definitely functional all right let's walk around I want to see this building on the end because I think this is kind of like if I'm right this will be like their athletics hi I'm just doing a YouTube video on your stadium it's a nice facility. I was actually talking to a football player as he was coming out. I think, yeah, so this, this is really smart. I mean, Oklahoma State has their athletics administration inside of gallagher -Iba. So what they did is they put their athletics administration on the end of the football stadium really smart move so and I'm assuming that there's also you know coaches offices and all that jazz this looks this is impressive I love the the mixture of the glass and the brick oh and then you have a acknowledgement coach Nicks 1952 to 1965 won five national championships. That's really cool. Okay. See? You got the Panther, very prominent. That one's a little sun faded, but it looks good. You know, of course you got stuff like this, you know, for rich alumni. <laughs> They donated th thousands of dollars, sometimes millions of dollars, to help build the place. I'm going to try to talk to some of these football players. It's on open gate, so I went through it. <laughs> It's 
concessions. Really nice. Lots of bathrooms. It's really good. There's your club and suite. Really nice. What I'm talking about. I think we could do something like this in Oklahoma State. See how KJ Black, Jerry, Lovelock. Banners like that or something like they do like at uh, A&M. So this is the opposite side. This is really neat. It's like this looks just as good as the other side that's facing the road. This is pretty cool. Most schools skimp on the side that's not facing the road, but they didn't do that here. All right, Prairie View A&M, I wanna see this sign. Prairie View A&M Foundation, founded June 2009, mission of the from maximize effect contribution supports future excellence in education research and athletics at Prairie View A&M. All right. So this is 20. Okay. So that must be up there. This. Okay. That's cool. That's cool. So they got, you know, ba baseball and and so softball and there are other facilities. Oh, okay. Here's some more of those banners. Donald Babers. Sasha and Pete, <laughs> the Panthers, <laughs> Jerome Howard, gold member. All right, that's really cool. I like the ramps to get up. What I've noticed though is, like the metal, there's no rust. It's it may be exposed metal, but there's no rust. It looks really good. At least next. To the end zone, you have their track and field. That's some nice facilities. I don't even think we have a stands that big at at, uh, at our tr new track and field. That's interesting. I'm gonna wrap this up at the, here in a minute. Well, pleasant surprise. On my way to the Rice game, I had read about Prairie View A&M. I wasn't sure where they were, and then I saw the sign, and I was like, I'm going to go check it out. I was amazed that both sides looked pretty much the same. They didn't skimp out on the, on the opposite side that doesn't face the road. It's a really nice-looking stadium. I love the use of the banners, and I love how they've incorporated the color purple into everything. It's on the, it's on the gate signs. It's, it's everywhere. And so... It, overall, it's, I mean, obviously this is not a D1 or FBS facility, but it's a good looking football stadium. I think the banners would be um, something that we could use at Oklahoma State. Um, obviously not everybody who played there is going to end up on the, uh, not everybody that played there is going to end up on the Ring of Honor. It's just, it's not, you know, you got Barry, you got Thurman, um, my mind just went blank as far as the gentleman that just got uh, uh, inducted last year or this a couple weeks ago. Um, played in the 1940s. But, uh, you know, maybe like a Leslie O'Neill deserves to be up there. Or um, I, I personally think that Rashawn Woods deserves to be up there. But there's not, there's maybe like 10 or 12. I don't know. But the rest of the players that, that did make an impact and that were good football players, you can put banners up like either like they did or like uh, what Texas A&M did. And I think it would add to the atmosphere there at Boone Pickett Stadium. So headed to Rice. Uh, please remember, if you're new to the channel, please hit like and subscribe. And from the bottom of my heart, I want to thank you for watching. And I hope you have a great day.